Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to walk you through the steps and how you download apps on your Apple TV. So if you're in the Apple TV page like I am currently, we can click the back button on our remote to get us back to our home screen that has all of these different tiles on it. And what we want to do from here is go down and select the App Store icon. And once we're in the App Store, we have a lot of different options. So the Discover option, which we start on, we can go down and look through the different apps to discover in this area. We can go over and select to take a look at more apps in the Apps tab. But if you know the name of the app that you're looking for, you can also go all the way over to the side and click on the Search and then start typing in the name of the app that you'd like to download. So let's say for me, for this example, I want to download Twitch TV. So I start typing that in and then I can go down here and find the Twitch TV application. Click select on that and then click select on where it says get. And then again, click select on where it says get. Now, if you haven't already logged in to an Apple ID on your Apple TV, it's going to prompt you to do so at this point in time. And I'll post a link down in the video description. If you need to set up an Apple ID, it'll take you over to there where you can set that up. But for me on this page, I'm going to enter in my Apple ID and then click continue and then type in the Apple ID password. After successfully logging in with my Apple ID, which is the email that I have linked up with my Apple account, as well as the password and logging in. The next thing it takes us to is the two-factor authentication. A message with a verification code has been sent to my iPad. Enter the code to continue. And for you, this verification process might be different. It might be on a different device or a different way to do this. But for me, it's going to my iPad. And on my iPad, after clicking allow, it's giving me the code of 719566. So I'm going to type that in. Obviously, the code that you get is going to be unique to you and different than the one that I just typed in. And then it's asking me after making a purchase with my Apple ID, do you require a password for additional purchase on this device? You can change this setting at any time in the settings, go to user and accounts, and then click on your account. And for me, I'm going to never require this, but if you want that added layer of security, you can require after 15 minutes or always require it. But again, I'm going to do the never require option. And after you're successfully doing that, it's going to download and install the Twitch app. And now I can open it from this page, but I'm going to go back to my home screen. And we can now see from the home screen of the Apple TV in our tiles, I now have the Twitch TV option, so I can click select on that. And then it launches that application. So again, going back to my home screen, and this is how you go about downloading applications onto your Apple TV. I hope this video was helpful. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel, and I'll catch you back here next time.